Hi, welcome on to Arsenal Fan TV and it's the Mondo Gold Challenge. As we get into week number two, first of all, let's give you the results of week one. In first place was Redmen TV, about the time they had a first place. Second place, Arsenal Fan TV more. And bottom of the pile last week were Ball Street. So I need a strong week. You know what? I've been kind of suffering a bit because Spurs... I've been playing pretty well. Now, all these other guys, they keep opting for Spurs players. You know me, in my Mondo Gold team, no Spurs players. That's like a ruler I've got. And because they're playing pretty decent at the moment and the others are able to pick them, my results are suffering a bit. But I'm sticking to my principles. I'm a principal man and I ain't breaking them. So let's get into this week's team. Um, where my laptop at? Bull Street, you're not the only one that can do the gimmicks, mate. Anyway, listen, I ain't got no time for gimmicks. It's time to get into my team. And I, I've gone for a very, very strong team this week. Uh, the whole league is based around Sunday's games. So basically, the games in question where we're going to pick our teams from in the forfeit league is Tottenham versus Chelsea, West Ham versus West Brom, Norwich versus Arsenal, and Liverpool versus Swansea. When you look on it on paper... You look at it and say, apart from the Tottenham-Chelsea one, a bit hard to call, but on form, you've got to go for Spurs. West Ham should be beating West Brom, but you saw what West Brom done to us last week, even though they hardly touched the ball. Uh, Norwich, Arsenal should beat them, and Liverpool should be destroying Swansea, especially the way they played last week against City. But you know what the Premier League's like. It always bites you in the bum. But anyway, let's get into my team. In goal, I've gone for Adrian. 5.3 million. Uh, I'm hoping that he's going to keep a clean sheet against West Brom. Uh, at the back, I've gone Hector Bellerin playing on the right. Uh, or, you know, as usual, I've got my free formation at the back. Hector Bellerin, Gary Cahill. I had to think long and hard about this one. But, um, you know, I mean, last time Chelsea played Spurs, they got smashed at White Hart Lane. So I'm a bit worried about that pick. But I've gone Gary Cahill uh, playing in the middle and Martin Skirtle for Liverpool, 7.7 .7 million. <clears throat> Excuse me. In the midfield, uh, Mesut Ozil. I've been using him week in, week out, and he's been delivering for me. One of the most... He's the most expensive player at the moment in the midfield at 15.3 million, but it's money well spent. I think he's going to tear Norwich apart this weekend. I've got Edin Hazard, who's starting to come back to what he was last season. He needs a massive game, and so I'm banking on him to have a big game against Spurs. 12.2 uh, million. Now, here's a steal. Manuel Lanzini for um, West Ham. This guy, I, I'll be really impressed with this guy. 6.4 million, really, really cheap. I reckon he could get a goal as well against West Brom. He's the guy who's going to be starting to step up now that Dimitri Payet is injured for West Ham, so I'll put him in. And I've gone Jordan Ibe. Liverpool, again, Liverpool playing Swansea. Ibe uh, is a very, very good player, very underrated. Only 5.4 million. I think that's a steal. Up front, I've gone big. I've gone Alexis Sanchez, 11.3 million. Got two goals the other night. Looked sharp as well against um, West Brom, even though he didn't score. I think he's going to be in the goals this weekend against Norwich. They're going to find it really hard to keep, with his, uh, keep up with his direct running. Olivia Giroud, 8.8 .8 million. Listen, away from home, he's lethal. He bangs in goals, especially good in the air. And I think he'll get a goal or two um, against Norwich. And I've gone for Roberto Firmino. Had a great game last week. I'm really impressed with this guy. Um, he's a very, very good player. And I think that his, his performance last week is going to give him a lot of confidence against Swansea. And I fancy him to get a goal. So that's my team for this week. Let's see what the other guys have done. So let's get into Ball Street's team. Let's see who they've picked. They've gone uh, Simon Millionaire in goal. I was going to go for Millionaire, but he's so dodgy, you just can't depend on him to keep a clean sheet. Uh, so they've gone for him in goal. They've gone Moreno at the back, Liverpool, Hector Bellerin and Eric Dyer. This is what I'm saying. They can pick Spurs players. I, I don't really go for that, but they can. They've gone Coutinho. I was going to go for Coutinho, but doubts about whether he'll be fit or not. That's why I didn't want to pick him and then he didn't get played. Uh, they've gone Aaron Ramsey. Yeah, not a bad shout. Ramsey's back. Um, not sure if he'll start because he's just coming back from an injury. They've gone Christian Eriksen. And they've also gone for Lanzini. So they're having a bit of a think about this. 
Um, up front, they've gone Firmino. Uh, good shout. Joel Campbell, they've gone for. Uh, 5.4 million. And Harry Kane. So, all right. That's a bit creative, should I say. Uh, there's no way they're going to win the, um, next week with that team. That ain't got enough goals in it. I'm sorry. That has not got enough goals in it for me to... Uh, win it but listen they it was for them to prove me wrong but I can't see it with that red men tv in goal they've gone pet a check 7.6 million so they're fancying check to keep a, a clean sheet against Norwich head to Bellerin at the back so all three of us have gone for head to Bellerin skirtle they've gone for Dawson from West Brom so they they're sort of pinning their hopes on it looks like they, they think that West Brom are going to beat uh West Ham away uh, Ozil they've gone for, um, same as me, they've gone Deli Alley, 6.1 million. <laughs> Deli Alley suspended. Deli Alley is suspended. Last week, remember, he got that second yellow. He, uh, he got the yellow card in the game, which I think brought him up to five yellows, which means he's suspended for this weekend, which means no points. Do these guys know anything about football? Do they watch football? Redman, do you, apart from watching Liverpool, do you watch any other football, right? Uh, James Milner up front, 7.8 million. Yeah, he's really going to score a load of goals, isn't he? Yeah. Um, and uh, Morrison, they've gone, uh, are they looking to lose this? they deliberately looking to do a forfeit or something. Uh, up front, Firmino, that's good. Sturridge, will Sturridge start though? That's the thing. I mean, if he starts, fair play, that's a good shout. But you never know with Sturridge. And they've gone for Harry Kane at 13.6 million, which not a bad shout, but you know my policy on Spurs players. So those are their two teams. Uh, you know what? When I look at it, I feel I've got the strongest team. You know what it's like in this thing. That doesn't always mean that, um, you know, you're going to win this thing. But we've been fairly consistent here on Arsenal Fan TV. So that's my team. Don't forget to enter your Mondo Gold team. Check out the link um, below. You can enter the Cash League. You can enter our Forfeit League. But make sure you enter your league. It's great fun. And uh, I don't know. Uh, looking at those teams, I think I'm looking good for this week. I think Alex Neal is definitely good enough to, to manage Arsenal when, uh, when Wenger retires. I think 